Hello ladies and gentlemen, anything Peterson, back with another video and it's in my search of reactions to the Vampire Diaries, my daily upload, it's Thursday, which means the Vampire Diaries um, TVD um, and we're at episode uh, 6 of season 1, It's this is called Lost Girls and in the last episode we had a really good um, episode with, um, it ended up with Damon escaping his little like prison or the cell he was in down in the basement of the house and um, he immediately attacked Vicky when he got out um, so th that was kind of uh, a bad start for him once again um, but yeah uh, he, he also killed their uncle so um, yeah I know a couple of you guys also have said that it's just the beginning like Stefan can also get to be bad or something in the comments but right now I'm on Team Stefan, I can tell you that for a fact, um, or actually Team Elena, probably. Um, but yeah, we also saw that news reporter uh, taking the, the pocket watch from, um, I can't remember Elena's little brother's name right now. Um, but yeah, he, he took it away from him again, and I'm really going to be excited to watch how, how, how they'll approach. Uh, trying to like uh, hunt down these vampires cuz like which, which what equipments are they going to use like have they done it before or something like that but I feel like if we'll get a pretty interesting episode because Damon's, Damon's, Damon is out again if I can speak probably um, and uh, yeah uh, Stefan is probably going to notice at the start that it's him that attacked Vicky um, even though she survived um, yeah, and it's it's probably gonna end up in chaos. Maybe Matt is gonna be acting a bit weird. Yeah, it's just gonna be intense because Elena also discovered that he was a, va a vampire, kind of. I if it if it starts there, it's gonna be amazing. She she walked up to his front door, just confronted him with it, and there it ended. Um, and the look in in her eyes and the way she puzzled it all together, we saw um, we saw how it worked in her brain. Like she had those flashbacks of things occurring. My, this is gonna be exciting to watch. So yeah, let's just jump right into it. Whoa, I got gotcha. you. I know. I think you have the wrong person. You haven't aged a day. There are things that, that you was don't so know. Things that I weird, want to um, tell you, but fantastic. I can't. Are you sure that the man knew? Here, I think she says. What in the world? Oh, a flashback. That's actually pretty exciting. 1864. Wow. That's him. No, don't say that's also a witch. And that's Catherine. That is so are you cool. Ready for that? What are you? I'm a vampire. I'm a vampire. I shouldn't have come. No. Please. No. Please. No. <laughs> How did you do that? Oh. Elena. How can you try to escape that? I would never hurt you. You're safe with me. What in the world? It's wrong with him. I'm just gonna burn them. When you Google vampire, you get a world of fiction. That's the reality. I can tell you whatever you want to know. I know you eat garlic. Yes. 
And somehow sunlight's not an issue. Hi, here you go. He got a ring. We have rings that protect us. Crucifixes? Decorative. Holy water? Drinkable. Mirrors? Myth. You said you don't kill to survive. Animal blood keeps me alive, but not as strong as Damon. He can be very powerful. And yet you let him get involved with Caroline? Forcing Damon not to do something is much more dangerous, believe me. We'll have to check their dental records. What story should I run? Drug deal gone bad. That's not too big a stretch. I got the Gilbert watch. Good. I love that they're, they're just speaking openly about it. Vicky Donovan. I'm so gonna regret this. Oh. Okay. Okay. Drink up. Ew. Drink it up. Ew, that's so gross. Don't drip. There you go. Good girl. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That's it. it looks so old. It's because they are. Wait, how long have you... I've been 17 years old since 1864. Damon made it seem like... Damon was trying to make you think that I was still heartbroken. He saw that I was happy with you, and he wanted to ruin it. All oh, because you love the same woman 145 years ago? She wasn't just any girl. <laughs> Was she a vampire? I didn't care that I had gotten something that my brother wanted. I didn't even care if it hurt him. I only knew that I wanted her. So he was upset. That's the thing about Damon. He doesn't get mad. He just gets even. Oh no. So she was a vamp vampire. Oh my god. I just knew it. Good morning. Leave the What is with that what is it with that watch? Tracker? Someone's gonna interrupt it now. Logan or Stefan or... Is she going to be a vampire? That's my question. And I'm going home now. Okay, fine. I'm just warning you. Actually, you know what? You should go. In fact, if I were you, I would stop by your boyfriend Jeremy's house. Yeah, whatever. Bye. Tell Lena I said hi. And if you see Stefan, tell him to call me. I'm a bit confused over here. It contains an herb called vervain. 
protects you from being compelled. I wanted to protect you from Damon's influence. So she's going to remember when he tried to protect you from me. Elena, you should never take that necklace off. Because no matter what happens after today, no matter how you feel about me, you'll know that you were free to make your own choice. What's going on? She's really messed up. Elena, back up. Vicky. You're gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Guys, take her up to bed, shut the blind. She's gonna be okay. Come on. Come on. You know what's wrong with her? Yeah. What is it? She's transitioning. Come on, Stefan, you gotta be there. You're afraid of me. I'm gonna go on a limb here and guess. Stefan finally fessed up. Stay away from me. Hey, 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 there's no need to be rude. I'm just looking for Stefan. Make him in? Oh, wait. Of course I can. I've been invited. We can cut to the chase if you want. I'm not gonna kill you right now. That wouldn't serve my greater agenda. Even. What will happen if I don't? You'll fade quickly. And then it'll all just be over. <laughs> Bite him, Vicky. Come on, Vicky. Still in shock. It's wood. <sighs> they know. Sorry. I gave you today just like you asked. And I understand that you would never do anything to hurt me. And I promise I will keep your secret, but... I can't be with you, Stefan. It's a bit emotional, actually. <laughs> wow. That's just, that just changed pretty quickly. Yeah, guys. Um, hands down, the last time I said it was the best episode in the series so far. It has changed again. Um, I mean, I've, I've got a almost full paper of just things I wrote down. Um, so many things came up in this episode and so many different people got to know so many different things and the ending was also sad i don't even know where to start like i'm just gonna make a pretty long review now so stick with me if you want to hear my opinion and stuff um so yeah we started out with the flashback and i, and I kind of like that we saw from 1864 uh 
I think it was um, in Mystery Falls where Catherine came and we had Stefan there and um, that was before he, wa he was a vampire and uh, yeah then we also had uh, what was it in the woods where Damon had um, Vicky yeah okay uh, and he was still drinking from her blood that was kind of kind of pretty weird um, because it was also such a long oh sorry it was some other people's blood but um, yeah wow and uh, then then we had the thing with um, Elena coming up to to um, Stefan's house and he told her everything that was that was pretty pretty awesome um, and uh, yeah we were at Damon's house where Ricky were and they were just crazy like dancing all over the place uh, drinking uh, it was kind of weird and uh, I noticed a little fun thing it was kind of fun I don't know why I wrote it down but he like when he was in the house there was some you know flash from the sun down on the on the floor and he just stepped out of there and uh, we could also see like how the sun affected him his fingers once in this episode were like all red and almost looked as if it was about to burn off or something um and uh, yeah we found out that he became a vampire in 1864 like confirmed i don't think we've seen that before um so that must mean that he's born in what is it um 1847 or something he was 17 right um and yeah, we, we, we got some more flashbacks there where we saw Catherine choose, choosing between Stefan and and, uh, and Damon um, when they were, they were playing football. And uh, yeah, she took she chose Stefan, at least Stefan told um, her, uh, Elena that. And, uh, and then we saw probably the most gross, gross thing we've seen so far when um, Vicky... And Damon were like drinking each other's blood at the same time. That was so bad. I'm sorry to say, but it wasn't really a pleasure to watch that. Um, and then we had some more flashbacks where we saw that Catherine was a vampire. I, I kind of had figured it out because he said to Elena that she wasn't a normal girl, and I thought like maybe it was her. Um, so I'm pretty, pretty interesting in knowing how she died. She was probably like the vampire starting it all in that town because she like came there or something um and she she said something about uh when he was all um you know confused Stephen well confused after she bit him and he w woke up and she said that him Damon and uh, her should have like no rules at all it would just be fun for forever because they would be ram vampires um so yeah, that that's just I, I want to know know how she died. Uh, don't tell me, but I want to know. You know what I mean. Uh, and then there was this thing about the pocket watch, and now I can pretty much see why they wanted. But I've got so many questions. Like, how does it work? Um, uh, yeah, Vicky was about to get transformed into a vampire or something, and. Uh, she, she had to feed him blood or die, so yeah, it was kind of a dilemma there. Lena didn't want Stefan to like find a person to kill for her to survive, and at the same time, she didn't want Vicky to die, so it's kind of a hard decision to take. And uh, they, they had like a choice um, where you know, Elena also mentioned it when, when they were about to become a vampire. Stefan must have bit something also, you know, to become a vampire after Catherine bit him. Um, and she she mentioned it uh, a couple of times also for Damon, I think. Something else. Uh, I kind of like that she said that because that like makes you remember that they also were in that state, you know. They, they didn't have any clue about any of this once. And uh, wow, I got this... Biggest shock. I've gotten some shocks in this series by Damon's jump scares in the previous, in the first couple of episodes. But this one, when he, when he got shot, I know Logan was coming. I said it myself when they were out in the woods. But that wooden bullet just came out of nowhere, and uh, 
then he was saved by Stefan and she bit Logan. I thought she w she was gonna do it before, like to save him, but then Damon just came out of nowhere. Um, it was awesome to see him like, he just didn't want Stefan to die. They, I think they still got something together, like even though they've had so many years where they hated each other, I feel. Um, but I also liked that Damon took out that wooden bullet and, it, and then he was just like, they know. So now, they know that they know that they were vampires. Um, so the Salvatore brothers know. Um, and then she wa ran away, Wiki. We got three vampires now. And we ended up with uh, Elena crying uh, on the other side of the door after telling Stefan that she didn't want anything with him to do. Uh, she, that was... I, I didn't feel any emotional or anything watching that, but... Like after it was kind of emotional. I don't know why it just like changed like this. Um, uh, she she kind of said it the whole time. I felt like she was gonna say it uh, because it was too weird, too hard to like um, get into all of that at the same time. But yeah, eventually in the end she couldn't do it, and uh, she she I feel as if she instantly regretted it when she was on the other side of the door. She just collapsed and uh yeah cried um so really a good episode this was a bit of longer review than normal but i hope you enjoyed still um wow we'll see where this is gonna go i don't know if logan's dead um but yeah three bodies found um phew. wow please tell me down in the comments what you thought of this episode uh you can't tell me that this that there's a lot better than this if there is this that's awesome because this is really, really a good episode. Um, wow. In six episodes. I've seen six episodes so far. And it's already like a really good series. Uh, I'm already feeling like I'm getting really good into it. So um, you will just see where it's going to go from now. And uh, thank you so much for watching my reaction and review. Um, if you enjoyed, please leave a like. Uh, and comment what you thought, as I said. Comment suggestions. Comment for my new Q&A if you've got any questions. Um, and then check out my Patreon if you want. And then see you in my next video. Bye.